Hello Rex Nation and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be finishing off the um, Daniel Bryan Team Road to Glory event. So I'm just going to get straight into this and play the final few games. And uh, yeah, I just want to thank everyone for watching my Twitch streams recently. The uh, support has been absolutely amazing. And because of that, I've decided that we're going to start the, uh, the YouTube channel back up. So here I am with the first video on WWE Supercard in a long, long, long time. And yeah, uh, like I said, support has been amazing. So we're going to see how long we can keep this going on for. Uh, I'm going to be aiming to release videos onto YouTube every Monday, Wednesday and Friday, which uh, coincidentally is also the same days that I'll be streaming. So my plan is to have you guys come along, watch the streams, and immediately after, send you over to a YouTube video for you guys to all watch. Uh, just so that, even though I'm offline, there's still more content on WRE Supercard that you guys can go and see. So, uh, we're currently 3-1 up in this match, and we need to go for power, so we're going to use the Fiend Grey Wyatt. And it's looking like we're going to win this. Hopefully this will be the last match that we uh, we have to play. But we we might have to play one more, so we'll see. And then we'll go through and claim all of the uh, cards in this event. So if you guys had any pros in this event, please let me know down in the comments below. That would be amazing. And also let me know how far you guys got with your teams. I'm assuming most people managed to finish the event completely. And just like we're about to do. And I think Tommaso Ciampa in Vanguard tier is a pro for me. So I'm going to be working to try and level him up. Because even though he won't fit into my top 8 deck. He will fit into my Road to Glory deck. Which will help me start getting some event cards eventually down the line. And yeah, my, my Road to Glory deck is quite weak. Just because I've uh, been off the game for over a year. I think it was about 18 months, uh, Reese was telling me on stream, but <laughs> here we are, finally back, and slowly starting to improve our Rotogory deck, and we should be top tier by the time that the new tier Amethyst, I believe it's going to be called, will be released. So we're just going to go finish this game up, I believe it was 12-2 in the end, let's have a look, yeah 12-2. So that is an easy win, and we might have to play one more game here today to finish off this card. Let's get our final picks off of the board. I haven't had a tier pull in quite a while. That would be pretty amazing if I managed to capture it live on a, on a recording. But, <laughs> unfortunately we didn't even get a reset then. So we're just going to hop straight back into this match, and I'm going to quickly speed through this for you guys. So I'll see you just after. So we're just about to play the final match here for Daniel Bryan. Uh, I'm going to try and get through this as quickly as possible, all four rounds. Pick up those five points and then go through and claim all of the cards in the event. So we're going to tag with Big Show and McIntyre. That is compatible tag, so we get a little bit of a bonus there. Take on The Rock and was that Trent Seven? I will never know. <laughs> and then we're going to go with Asker and Asker. And we're facing Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair, who do get a compatible tag. Uh, this might be a loss for us. No, we still managed to come out on top with that. So we're now 2 and 0. Oh, won both of our matches so far. And next up, I can see a compatible tag between Ardrew and Rollins. So we're going to go and play with Brock Lesnar. And we get an easy win there. And then here is the tag team match. So we're going to send it on our compatible tag. And that is a win easily. And then we're going to send in Titus O'Neil on his own against Bray Wyatt. 
to pick up the final point in this round and now moving on to round three we have got well we have to pay play Nia Jax there and she loses to Ember Moon that's our first loss of this match and then we can do a compatible tag between Otis and let's go with regular Bray Wyatt instead of the Fiend card because the Fiend card is stronger so it doesn't need the compatible tag boost so when we play on its own now it should pick up an easy win there not even a challenge for that card <laughs> it's got equipment and everything on it so um, there aren't any compatible tags but what we can do is send off Daniel Bryan and Seth Rollins we will pick up a win against Cedric Alexander and Rizar and then our final match is a tag team between um, Inc. we have an incompatible I think we might just pick up the win here I'm not too sure we do we win we fi finish on a win and there is the final last five points. Apparently I get none of them because my team already finished the card. But we have managed to get Daniel Bryan. So we're going to get these six draft picks off of the board. And then we're going to go ahead and claim all of the cards. So there we go. Daniel Bryan, let's just claim him quickly. That is my third ever WrestleMania 36. So we have still got quite a way to go. We've got another Royal Rumble single in Triple H. We get Tomasa Champa Vanguard, which is going to be a pro card for me. So I will start training that up immediately after this. And then we get some a Primal Nightmare card. I've already claimed Eric because I was the last person to play the match with him. Then we go on to claim the Undertaker Cataclysm. Pete Dunn, Wrestling Year 35, and finally, Shattered Johnny Gargano. So, there we go guys, that is the Team Road to Glory, Daniel Bryan complete. If we just look through here, let's see if we can train up our Daniel Bryan card, where is he here? Uh, what cards can we use to, uh, let's, let's go through our Beast and Monsters, that's about 150 cards, that gets him up to level 63, nice. And WrestleMania, that gets him up to level 71. I wonder if we can get him up to level 100 in this video. Let's, let's keep going. That only gets five levels, okay. Let's, use, let's go up to WrestleMania 35. Let's use all of these cards. And that gets him up to 86. So we can use our Undertaker cat Cataclysm that we just got in the Road to Glory. And maybe go up to Summer Sam Nightmare. I don't think I need this Randy Orton card, so we're just going to get rid of that and hopefully that gets him up to level 100, it does, that is perfect. So there is Daniel Bryan, you guys can now see him in my top 8 deck. Uh, we've only moved a little bit but we are slowly but surely making our way up to WrestleMania 36 tier. So guys thank you so much for watching. I will be back with a, another video every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I believe this one's going to go up on Wednesday, so I will see you all on Friday. And also, if you haven't already, make sure you go ahead and follow me on Twitch, LJRexYT. The link will be in the description. I will be live streaming every single Monday, Monday Wednesday, Friday from 1pm till 4pm UK time. So, until next time, peace.